They did the right thing in this situation. A seven magnitude earthquake is not a small earthquake, and the, uh, it, it could have been devastating. Amy Palmer is referring to the tsunami warning that was issued Thursday here in the Bay Area and along the West Coast after the 7.0 earthquake struck offshore along the Northern California coast. Palmer is deputy director of the California Governor's Office of Emergency Services. Sometimes when the earthquake happens a little further out, there are buoys that give us some indication of how big the waves might be. In this case, we didn't have that data. After the warning was issued Thursday and before it was canceled, some San Franciscans went to Coit Tower, the highest spot in the city's North Beach neighborhood. Merry Christmas! Woo! In Sausalito, where there was a Christmas tree lighting Thursday night, the talk was still all about those tsunami warnings that went out. I didn't panic that much. It begs the question, how safe are we here in the Bay Area if a tsunami hits? Costas Sinolakis heads USC's Tsunami Research Center. And we are not yet scientifically at the point that we can predict immediately after an earthquake, after a big offshore earthquake, how big the tsunami would be. Tsunami scientist Jose Barrero says that if there was a tsunami, waves would likely look different after coming under the Golden Gate Bridge and into the San Francisco Bay. Generally, we're not, we wouldn't be thinking of like uh, the big mammoth wall of water somewhere inside the bay. Um, yeah. That's, a, of course, a different story if you're, you're outside on the open coast. Barrero says there are exceptions, though, and Sinolaki says that those in cities along the San Francisco Bay should still use caution. Even, you know, small tsunami waves can generate really large currents. When the earthquake is so close and in the first minutes that it happens, we really do not know that information very well. So it's important to actually always err on the side of caution. J.R. Stone, ABC7 News.